people. Visitors are good. Yeah, we are taking the bus. Oh. It's windy today. State Parks, I would like to welcome you to Hearst San Simeon State Historical Monument, better known as Hearst Castle. As we begin the riding portion of your tour, we ask for your cooperation. Please stay seated at all times and keep your head and arms inside the windows. Please turn your cell phones to mute. If you have trash to dispose of, there will be a trash container when you exit. Bottled water is allowed but food and chewing gum are not permitted on the bus or during the walking tour. We thank you for your assistance in helping to maintain this beautiful place. The road you are traveling is the same one the art collector and newspaper publisher William Randolph Hearst traveled when he began building this estate with his architect Julia Morgan in 1919. They worked on this project for 28 years. We will pass a large Spanish-style house built in the 1930s as the poultry ranch manager's residence. It is still used by Hearst Ranch employees today.
Have you folks been here before? You have? Has it been a while? All right, so I have a question for you. Are you missing your bed? You might be drunk. Poseidon. No, that's not Poseidon, it's Neptune. <laughs> that, Neptune! This is the Neptune pool. Uh, she's actually about 3,200 to 3,400 years old. And her name is Sekhmet. Uh, her name means the powerful one. And she was known to be a bloodthirsty warrior goddess. Uh, some said she had the power to heal with her knowledge of sorcery. Um, some knew her as the protector of the sun god Ra and the pharaohs. There's a lot of descriptions of her in Egyptian mythology. Uh, she's got the head of a lioness and the body of a female. Um, she's not broken on the top. That's not a crack. Uh, that pink one. Wow, Popular. You know, the outdoor pool, he and I do is for a rose garden. His wife said she wanted a pool for the boys in the summer. He's also out here for holidays. Thanksgiving and Christmas. But his girlfriend's birthday is January 3rd, so it's really good. That's a good job. Have you lived? I don't know. Have you lived? Please tell what kind of value on it. Yeah. It's Yeah, 
your hand you are only can see now as you go. You can just put a plug up to the Kindo Roma Pool. advanced for their time. In the late 1930s, when Mr. Hurst began to experience financial difficulties, many of his zoo animals were donated to California zoos, including in San Diego and San Francisco. The descendants of his zoo, which caused the most excitement today, are the... <laughs> we waited for you guys. There you go. So sweet. Very. 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 They're descendants of Mr. Hurd's original herd. There is another herd, the one that he was talking about on the day, south of the town of San Simeon down here. They came alongside the highway on the north side of Highway 1. They were out there this morning, just right up against the fence. They almost look like uh, there's a house there, almost like 